What's up guys, Chicks here from Chicks Tech Reviews. So today's video is all about clearing up some doubts in relation to SBDIF audio connections on a TV box. So for this example, I have two TV boxes in front of me, the X99 and the Tanix TX92. They both use completely different audio connections. So on the top, we have the X99, which uses the standard optical out connection. So you can use any regular fiber optical SBDIF cable and you've got your audio sorted. However, the Tanix TX92 has a SBDIF port, which looks like a regular 3.5 mil audio jack. Now this connection is a digital coax connection, so you cannot get a regular optical cable and put a Toslink adapter on and plug that in. Even if that does plug in, it will not work at all because this cable is an optical connection, but this TV box demands a digital connection. So the cable you're gonna need for the Tanix TX92 is called a digital coax cable. I'll put a picture of it on the screen so you know exactly what cable I'm talking about. Now, most recent Android TV boxes have this 3.5 mil digital connection. So this is the cable you're gonna to need to get yourself all sorted. So both connections will still give you Dolby DTS and 5.1 surround sound as long as your box supports it. So I know quite a few of you have asked me this question. So I decided to make this video and help you all out at once. So for your convenience, I will leave the links to the cables in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you all have a brilliant day. See you in the next one, guys.